I'm Piper Vaughn. With the general election just days away, local candidates are making their final push to earn your vote. I caught up with a couple of them today and talked to voters about how they feel going into the election. If, if they go vote, they, their voice is going to have an impact. Your voice matters. Making sure they get your friends to go out and vote because their voice also matters. I spent the morning with two of the candidates, Republican Jeff Crank and Democrat River Gasson. They are running to replace Representative Doug Lamborn in the 5th Congressional District, which includes most of El Paso County. Lamborn, a Republican, is retiring. Sean Vierhoff is the vice chair of the Colorado Young Republicans. He tells me how he feels heading into Election Day. We've got to be able to get our state so we can have a voice here in Colorado. It's exciting because it's you've got the last, you, the last little bit of adrenaline to go after the elect, little bit of the election, and it's exciting. Kaylin Lagama is a Democrat who has lived in Colorado since the 90s. She tells me even if you are on the fence for this year's election, your voice needs to be heard. Please come out and vote as if your life depended on it because it does. The two candidates tell me how they are still working to earn your vote. Our campaign is teaming up with the Working Family Party to make sure we can get those last minute texts out. Uh, to let, just remind people to turn in their ballot. We're doing four town halls this weekend. We had one yesterday at Rock Rimmon. We have one today here in Fountain. We have one later today in Peyton, and we have one on Monday in Monument. Whether they're a Democrat, Republican, unaffiliated, I mean, that's going to be my job after I win this race is to represent everyone here. So, uh, you know, going to their door and asking for their vote is one way you can you can get the, get them to feel good about who you are as a person, as a candidate, and that you're going to do a good job for them. It's too late to mail in your ballot, but you have until 7 p.m. on Election Day to turn in your ballot. You can also vote in person as long as you're in that line for the polls when they close at 7 p.m., no matter how long that line is. Piper Vaughn, News 5.